going on everyone? It's Dave Ginolfi with Scott Motorsports, and today I'm here to teach you how to change a lens in our prospect goggle. So right off the bat, a big misconception is that our outriggers have something to do with the lens locking system, which it doesn't. So I just want to advise everyone, be careful when you are changing the lens that you're not wrenching on these, because I have seen people snap them off. So our prospect is designed with two lens lock bars, one on the bottom, one on the top, which result in four locking tabs. What I like to do is hold the frame with one hand, not the foam, but the frame, with my thumb, grab the lens lock bar, pull the first tab out, same deal, second tab. Then I use another finger for the bottoms, just makes it simple, and then out comes the lens. Comes out, place that over there, and now I'm gonna take one of our clear lens, install it. So what I like to do is make sure all the lens locking tabs are out. As you're working on it, sometimes you're gonna bump them. Just make sure they're out, otherwise you won't get the lens in. And I like to start with the sides. So I just take the lens, put it up into the frame gutter, slide it into the corners using the tear off posts to kind of help guide it. So once I have one side in, I just switch over, do the same thing on the other end. Then again, this is all preference. It could be, you could do the bottom, the top, whatever you want, but this is just how I do it. And the, also the thing about our system was it wasn't meant to be as fast as you can do it or anything like that. It was all about safety. That was the result we were going after and that's what we achieved. So once it's in and the tabs are down, this lens, no matter how hard you pull it, this goggle, this lens isn't coming out. And that, that's what we wanted and that's what we got. So hope that helps and thank you.